Most passengers judge a landing by one thing, how smooth it felt. What they do not realize is how much the aircraft helped or did not. Crosswind landings are where flying stops being automatic. Roll, yaw, pitch, all fighting each other in the last few seconds. This is where design philosophy becomes physical because the aircraft either smooths it out or asks the pilot to do it themselves. On one side, some aircraft use flight control computers to actively assist roll and pitch coordination. Control inputs are blended, responses are smoothed, the aircraft helps manage cross-coupling during flare. The goal is stability, consistency, a calmer workload in gusty conditions. The landing often feels effortless because the system is working with you. On the other side, some aircraft require more direct pilot correction during flare. Inputs are more literal. Coordination is manual. The aircraft waits for the pilot to manage the crosswind. More hands-on, more physical, more dependent on technique and timing. This is not about which one lands better. It is about who is doing the fine tuning. One philosophy uses computers to iron out the chaos. The other leaves finesse entirely in human hands. Same wind, same runway. Different answers to who should shape the touchdown. So which would you rather feel? A smoother landing helped by automation or a landing earned entirely by pilot skill? Does assistance reduce workload or dilute technique? Because one aircraft quietly cleans up the mess and the other expects you to master it yourself.